Hey guys, aimlessly rambling here, and this is not a video that I really want to make, um, but it's one that I have to, so, <clears throat> um, I'm making this video about, um, YouTube user Oso Madison X, um, back in October, like before Halloween. I had sent out her package, <clears throat> and I still have not received mine. Um, she kept putting it off and putting it off, and um, it's just gotten really out of hand. It's been uh, forever since I've heard from her now, um, but I'll get to that later. It's been like a month now since I've even gotten a message back from her, so, um, yeah, okay, so here's this from, uh, October 27th, 2013, um, hey, still haven't heard from you, the package was delivered on the 24th according to my tracking. Which wasn't a big deal, I just wanted to make sure she had gotten my package and that it was actually delivered to her house. Um, because I always do that. I want to make sure that there's no, like, discrepancies with the tracking. So, then, um, I let a couple weeks pass and she just kept saying, I'll send it, I'll send it, which is, which is fine. Um, but she never did. Um... Yeah, here's, um, November 11th, um, I sent her a message saying, okay, it's fine, it's just been a while, that's all, let me know when you send it. Um, yeah, again, there's nothing wrong with that. I understand maybe one or two weeks, I get that. Life happens, life is obviously more important than this. Um, I understand, I, I get it. And she said she was having problems um, with her family, and school, and stuff like that, um, which again is fine. There were a couple messages where I sent her, um, that I was getting a little PO'd, that I had not, um, received my package yet. Uh, please, please remember to send my package out this week, because she kept saying, I'll do it this week, I'll do it this week, um, because she could only send the package out when she was home, not at school, um, not at college, and so she kept leaving the package at home, and she couldn't ask her parents to do it, which I understand, um, but it just kept happening every single week. Every single week was, oh, uh, next week I'll do it, I'll do it next week, um, I can't do it this week, I left it at home, something along those lines. Um, and so this is now December 28th, 2013, um, <clears throat> and this was us talking about how I had originally started the trade in October before Halloween, so I was not expecting there to be any issues with me leaving my apartment at college and coming back here to my house because I didn't want the package to arrive at my apartment if I was going to be here for winter break for um, a little over a month. So I said, um, it's fine, whatever's going on, it's fine. Uh, I think as long as you send it right after the weekend, bear in mind this is, like, around Thanksgiving time, I think. Um, I should still be able to get it at my apartment before I go home, so just please send it to the address that I gave you originally, and, um, it will be fine, and it will get there before I head home. Um, this, hold on, I just want to make sure my address isn't in this. Okay, um, she said she was having problems with her boyfriend, which again is fine. Um, I understand life happens. This is now December 8th, 2013. Um, hey, just wondering if you ever did send out my package. And she replied and said no again. Um, at this point I was telling her to, uh, send it to my home address because I was heading home Monday, um, the 14th was that date, and this was sent on December 11th, 
So I said, hey, I'm heading home on Monday. I'm going to give you my home address so that the package comes to my home instead of my apartment because I don't want it left there for a whole month. Um, she got back to me. Um, I kept saying after that, hey, still wondering if you're sending out my package because I'm going home on Monday, so it's kind of important that I give you the new address if you're not going to send it out. Um, yeah, um, on... I don't want to show you my address. On December 16th, 2013, I said, I haven't heard from you in two weeks. I never received a tracking number because the last message I have ever received from her, which I'll show you, said, I'm going to send the package out. I'll send you a tracking number once I've sent it. So I said, I haven't heard from you in two weeks. I never received a tracking number for you, so I'm assuming you never sent it. Uh, please, please send my package to my home address as I am home for the holidays now. It's now been around two months since I sent you your package. This is seriously ridiculous, and I'm very, very angry and upset. And then I just gave her my home address to make sure that it came to my house, not my apartment. On December 18th, I sent her another message. Uh, hey, still waiting to hear back from you. Um, I know it's the holidays and stuff, but it's been two months, and I haven't heard from you in two weeks. Again, here's my address. Uh, please send it to this address. December 20th, 2013. Still haven't heard from you. It's been 20 days. Your package never showed up at my apartment, so I'm going to rightly assume that you have not sent it. Please send it to my address. If you don't, if I don't at least hear back from you from the 27th, I'm sorry, but I will be making a video about this. Hence this video, which I am making now. So that was on December 20th. On December 24th, I sent her another message that said, You have until the 27th to get back to me, or I'll be making a scammer video on you. I understand this is Christmas, but it's been a month. Um, so, I understand she probably didn't check her laptop on the holidays, but there's no excuse for the other month that I have not heard from her. Um, on Christmas, I sent her, Hope you had a very Merry Christmas. If I do not hear from you by the 27th, I'll be posting a scammer video on you and about how you scammed me out of one of my most valuable squishies that I owned because I sent her um, my Tokyo Ayamo Kuramoto strawberry toast and she never sent me anything back. I'm really, really, really upset and sad and so angry that I really do not care at this point about the package. It's been three weeks, about a whole, almost a whole month since I've even heard from you last. At this point, I just want to warn other people not to trade with you. If you do ever choose to send out my package, please send it to, again, my home address. <clears throat> so yeah, and then I sent her one yesterday um, and said, the scammer alert video will be going up tomorrow. I'm done with this. I'm so upset. I traded you the rarest squishy that I had and you've ignored me for a whole month. This is ridiculous. I don't even want the package. I'm so done and over you and your channel. I don't know what your deal is, but you've waited two months now to send my package and ignored all of my messages now for almost a solid month. This is messed up and rude and I will never be trading with you again. If you still ever have, if you still even have my package, you can send it to the address that I've sent you probably five times now. And then I gave her my home address once again. So this is just getting really ridiculous. Let me show you the last message I ever got from her on do do do. do. Is that it? No, this one's in. Oh, so Madison X trade offer. December 1st, 2013. Keep in mind, I sent her her package before Halloween. This is the last message that I ever received from her saying, Hey, I'm going to send out your package now. That was it. I have not heard from her since December 1st. It is now almost New Year's. This is ridiculous. I finished packing extra extras into your package and I sent, set it next to my door. That way I'll remember to grab it on my way out. I'm a student teacher, so I will go to the post office straight from my elementary school and send it then. So sorry for the delay again. I will PM you with the tracking number once I get it. I never received a tracking number. I never got an email from my apartment saying that a package was there, and a package has not arrived at my house. So I'm going to assume that she has not sent my package. I have not heard from her in a month. It's been... Two months since I sent her her package before Halloween. It's now almost New Year's Day. This is ridiculous. I'm done with her. I'm so upset because her channel seems 
so legit, and she seems like such a good YouTuber. I mean, look, she has 1K subscribers. It's not sketchy at all. I don't know if something's going on in her life. If there is, that's fine. Just message me about it. This is the only thing that I don't understand. It's been a month since I've heard from her, so I just want to put this out there to be wary of Oso Madison X, even though it seems like she disappeared from the face of the earth. I'm really upset, and uh, yeah, so now that this is 10 minutes long, I'm just going to go... Thank you guys for watching this video. Bye.